this is just one of those days where there's nowhere else you'd rather be. back out on the water again today it uh it looks pretty good the water is blue right behind us here it's just this huge school of bait fish so when there's a lot of bait fish around that's a good sign chances are there's going to be some bigger fish out there that's what we're going for we're going to go spear fishing today uh riley and elena both also love spearing so one of the main things that brought us together is we're really keen to to get in the water and um try chase some fish um, Elena's on parenting duties today, so it's just Riley on board with us. And yeah, fingers crossed we can get our hands on a coral trout or, or something tasty like that, and then we'll take that back and have a bit of a cook up this afternoon. Anyway, as always, hope you guys enjoy this as much as we enjoy making it. We'll see you out there on the water. Good news is we've found some clear water. It's beautiful and blue, so we're gonna jump in and see if we can find some fish. Cutest part of the day. Giving birth to yourself through a wetsuit. What's on their grocery shopping list today? Red Emperor is gonna be number one. A coral trout would be nice, or a coronation trout. And what about the black spot tusky? Oh yeah, a notable omission. Then I guess maybe some wahoo out the back here. Good luck. Thank <laughs> you. got a coronation trout man these guys have got to be the prettiest fish in the ocean eh? that's a beautiful coronation trout these are the fish that I have the most trouble with shooting they're so cunning underwater uh, but for whatever reason this one gave me a chance today and these are my favorite eating fish <laughs> you say that for <laughs> today <laughs> nah, they're so good I just saw like a bit of a sand patch and I just dove down and had a little look under a ledge and hadn't seen anything and then as I was about to leave the bottom, I looked up and he'd come in curiously and was sitting over my right shoulder. So then I clicked record and normally at this point is when they spook and leave me for dead, but he hung around long enough and I managed to get a shot on him. I could tell you're excited because you're always so chill underwater and I saw you go like, <laughs> yeah, like whoa, what's happening? <laughs> The hell? <laughs> oh, nice that one, one, mate. That's a real one. Well done, bro.
Oh, <laughs> big wrestle. Oh, that's a ranking card. This is just one of those days where there's nowhere else you'd rather be. It's just so good out here. Guys, the good news is the weather just somehow keeps getting better and better. As you can see, it's just completely glassed off here. The water is crystal clear. Yeah, Tommy's about to get the drone up, give this place the best angle that it deserves because it's so, so special on a day like this. Yeah, bro. I'm Something swear. swooping him. Oh, eagle. It's a big eagle swooping Tom's drone. But the good news is because of that awesome spearing session we had, we've got more than enough food for us, whole of Agabon family, our whole family. So yeah, we can just really take it easy for the rest of the afternoon and see what other animals we can find. Yeah, bad the shot is. <laughs> <laughs> you shoot it from the top. I don't know. I thought that I nailed it. I really did. Mm. But it, it only it just helped. Yeah. Oh <laughs> that was brutal. So there was a, a romantic evening or afternoon being had by two turtles, but it turned out it was a filthy orgy. <laughs> it's like five of them going at it. Let's get him. <laughs> Drop something, Fran. He's going back for it. The fish. Yeah, yeah. Oh, they've come straight at Fran. Yes. It's good again. <laughs> So Fred's just slipped in on these dolphins. She reckons it had a huge GT in its mouth. We've just seen them in hunting. The GTs were hunting the bait fish and then the dolphins were hunting the GTs. That's so cool. Like mom and baby swimming together and the mom had the GT in her mouth. And then there was um, what I assume a dad. <laughs> They're swimming off by himself. <laughs> There is a massive whale breach to the left of it.
Don't let the black skin deter you, Elena. That's how I've been taught by some knowledgeable people to cook on a fire. You let it, all that skin go black and then that'll just all peel off to a beautiful white flesh underneath. Yeah, that's pretty good, isn't it? It's amazing. Breathe out. Look at the colors, colors, colors. G'day, everyone. everyone. <laughs> we just wanted to say quickly that Jack and I designed our 2022 limited edition calendar. We sure have. Yeah, we put so much effort and love into it. Yep. Yeah. Especially you. <laughs> That's right guys, and you at home can now pre-order your limited edition calendar. The photos are from season one and season two of The Great Adventure, which you guys are yet to see, but it's coming very soon. Thanks <laughs> see guys. See you guys, really appreciate it, thank you.